Good evening! Letters for Link, we have one letter! Here's your letter. I don't know why he gets that voice, but it's fun. How are you doing, Link? Do you have enough of granny soup? Where are you now? You may be closer than I suspect. Are you hungry? Are you keeping warm? You haven't you're injured yourself, have you? You're always, you always work so hard, Link. Do you have enough rupees? Your grandma doesn't have a lot, but I'm sending you everything I've saved up. As long as I have you and Ariel, I don't need anything else. I just want the two of you to return home safely. Love, Grandma. That's nice. Yeah. That's very nice. It's also a little bit sad that that's her entire savings is 20 rupees. She's a cute woman. Don't read into that. Anyway, hey guys and gals, I'm Pal, and welcome back to Wind Waker. Last time, oh, I'm joined by... Nova. <laughs> Last Very time. Very quietly. We got the Master Sword. And this time, we're going to be talking to Tot instead of going to the Forsaken Fortress, ending the game by defeating the main evil. That magical dance that changes day into night and night into day. If only I could recall the rhythm. Oh, the rhythm! Then I could dance it perfectly. Uh, I believe that if we do this... He'll react. There we go. Okay. Uh, uh, cha. Uh, uh, cha. That's, that's it. That's the rhythm I've been trying to recall. Oh, I can feel it. I can feel it, guy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I really want to cosplay him because he's <laughs> cosplaying Elvis. You should. Bow. The nod is necessary. Okay, uh, what is it? Like, uh, uh, uh. Did yeah, I do you it, have guy? To change the, vol the volume and make it louder. Oh, I should have. Then you are a true wind waker. You learned the song of passing! That's it! That's it! And it's perfect! I'm perfect! Now let the sun shine on! Yeah! Bow! Hey, what's the matter? Nothing happened. Nothing at all. Why? Well, maybe that's because you're lame, sir. Anyway, now with that song passing, we can change day into night and night into day, in case that wasn't blaringly obvious. And now that we have this magical power, which way is the wind going? Get your map out. Uh. You can't do that. Okay. <laughs> lame. Lame. <clears throat> lame. I can do it. I can do it. Ugh. Oh, so close. <sighs> I had faith. All right. Now that we've done this. All right. Oops. I was I was a bit confused on something. We're going in here, right? Mhm. Mm yes, I think. We were getting ahead of ourselves, and we were trying to complete something that cannot be completed yet. We've played this game before. Okay. Now, if we go into this room, in the dead of night. We Don't can break the do jars. something. Yeah, actually, okay, I want to try out a glitch. Um, okay. No, 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 no. Oh, snap. What you do is... This. No. Wait, wait, wait. No, okay. There's a, there's a glitch where you can use bombs indoors. I forgot how to do it. It involves inventory switching, but that's not why we're here. Well now, good evening. What was his voice? I don't remember. Yes, yes, I rent out the first floor of this mansion in order to run a nightly auction. And actually, tonight's auction is about to begin. Dear me, is it ever. Now it is indeed an auction, but I like to describe it in, a more, it in more simple terms. It is a competition of the highest order. Oh yes, it is a competition to see who can get the item that is being auctioned. Can you bit, outbid everyone else? Do you have the courage and the fundage? Oh, the drama. Ah, uh, but what's this? Dear me, do I detect a hint of curiosity? I believe I do. Fortunately, we welcome bidders of all ages, both kids and adults. So, tell me, would you like to participate in the auction? Uh, not tonight, because I want to see what is up for sale. I'm pretty sure we can... No, 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 no. Oh, I forgot there's a chest up there. Um... I don't think you can see what it is until the auction starts. Okay, well... You can always leave the auction, though. Okay. So let's let's start the auction. Uh, let us begin immediately. There is no time to dawdle. The auction is afoot. On your toes. On your toes. Is it just me, or does he talk kind of like Tom Nook? We already addressed this, and yes, he does. 
He, I, I put him and Tom Nook in the same category. Yes, yes, yes. First, let me thank all of you bargain-loving people for joining us this evening. Dear me, what a turnout. The auction is about to begin, yes. And what do you suppose will pop up as our item of the evening? Oh, dear me, I'm so excited, I can't stop sniff- sniffing? Sniffling? Sniffling. The calm before the auction storm always makes my nose run. Let's get to it. This evening, our glorious auction item is... This! Whoa. Wow. wow. That's fortunate. A fabulous piece of heart. And that's why we're here. Oh, dear me. What a prize. At last, the suspense is over. But all drama aside, you should know it is extremely rare to even get a chance to own a fabulous item like this. It is precious. Quite dear. Very valuable. S such valuable. Very good. <laughs> so heart. Yes, yes, yes. Listen well, because I do not lie. Let the auction begin. Okay, the pr opening bid is at 80 rupees, and... Begin! Okay. Now, if I mash A here, I can build up the bid bar. But I kind of want to bait out other people's bids a little bit. So, uh, it, will, it will naturally regenerate. So I just want to get it kind of high. And then throw in my bid. And my bid... After this guy is going to be uh, 91 rupees. How much do you bid? 91. 91 rupees. Uh. <laughs> That's a very strange um, reaction. Pal, I think the key to winning is to is to is to get them all to be stunned for the entire duration of the auction, so they won't bid. Really? Yeah. Eh, that's not my style. 100 rupees, son! Whoa, the bidding war much? How can they even use a piece of heart? The answer is they can't. To them, it's just probably decoration or something. Okay, let's build this thing up. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm paying top dollar for this. Go up by 20 rupees. 20? Yeah. I'm going up to 120. Because I'm, I don't like where this is going. No, I can't lose. I just can't. Okay, now that I have my my little victory, I'm gonna start building up the bar. 123 rupees! <laughs> also, this is a good way to learn the names of the people. <laughs> His name's Gummy. 126 rupees! <laughs> okay, after this guy, I'm gonna bid like one. Oh, my. he bid more, what I was gonna bid. Bid one, 150. 150? Mm hmm. It's so disgusting. No, it's not. You know what? I'm better than that. 149. 149. Oh dear me! Link bids 149 rupees and the crowd of auction goers reels! I see nothing but stunned faces! Gah, how did I get- how did I get stuck competing with this annoying little rich boy? Drat it! Okay, now I can- See, that's how you win. Time is running out, dear friends! Okay, let's build this thing up and then I can outbid people at the very last. What happens if I lose this auction? I don't know. Do I bid again? <laughs> okay, okay bid now. Okay. Go up by another 20 and keep him stunned. One t uh, another 20? Ugh, this is so disgusting. You know what, I'm doing that. 125 rupees is a lot. Oh, dear me! Ah, <laughs> uh, I can't believe this. This kid's rolling in dough. Okay, let's build this thing up as fast as possible. Just get ready for a last second bid. There isn't much time left, good people! Are you done bidding? Should I outbid myself? I guess, I guess, okay. Hopefully this will stun them. 180. Going up by five. Yes, 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 only five seconds remain! Oh boy. No, don't outbid me! No! 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 Come on! No! Oh, man. Did I lose the piece of heart? Like, is that just gone? Oops. I told you to keep him stunned. <sighs> but you were just too... stingy. I didn't want to pay 200 rupees for a piece of heart. That's a bargain. I got hearts for free. Okay, let's cut to this. Cut to when I get it. If you get it. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Piece of heart again. 
Good. Is that just... Is that just scripted? Oh. Oh, dear me! As you no doubt see, this is the l item that Vera won in our last auction. And yet, for reasons I cannot fathom, Vera has since parted with this <laughs> fine item, and thus it is once again appearing in our auction. She owned it for a good two minutes, and decided she didn't like it. It's like curse or something? And normally begin! Okay, I'm gonna do the shock and awe. I'll be Miley Cyrus for this, for this episode, with all the shock and awe. Uh. <sighs> and then here, here I am, just wanting to play League and watch the World Finals. But no! Oopsie. I didn't mean to do that, actually. Okay, let's do, do this again. I bid one ruby higher, but apparently going by eBay strategies is not how you do this. No, it's not. Seriously, how you, how you win and get stuff at eBay is just bid, like, in the last ten seconds. I won't let it stop there. Shut up, Zu Zukari, whatever your name is. Z what is what is his name? Zunari? Zunari. Z I would say his name should be Zucchini. Okay, 130. Would that shock and awe them enough? Probably. I'll do 132, so it's an even 30 above. Oh, dearest me, incredible! The drama! Everyone is struck speechless at Link's bid! Now get it up to halfway and then just leave it. Okay. This is good. This is good. I like the face here. I like Abraham Lincoln on the far right. Do you see Abraham Lincoln? Look at Abraham Lincoln. Oh, you missed Which it. Which one's Abraham Lincoln? Far right. Not him. Time is running out, dear friends! Okay, shock and awe, shock and awe, shock and awe. Uh, what should I go? 160? Yeah. yeah. One, 160. 160! Oh, damn! Oh, okay, I'm skipping this. Okay, look, look, Elvis. Or not Elvis, sorry. Uh, Abraham Lincoln. Abraham Lincoln right there with sideburns. See him? Yeah, I guess. I need to bring this up again. Okay. And it's... My bid is directly after his. Or not, I guess. There isn't much time left, good people! Okay. Stun them again. 200, right? 200? Yeah. Uh, up, 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 up. No, 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 no. <laughs> 206, there. Oh, dear me! Link bids rupees! <laughs> okay, let's, let's build it up again, just in case we need to blast them again with our insane wallet. Five seconds remain, okay. Blast them with the wallet? Let's blast them with my wallet! <laughs> <laughs> How much will you outbid yourself for? 20, right? Mm -hmm. uh, no, no, no. 20. Okay, I will win this auction. I will be the winner. There we go. And sold! Here ends the auction. Tonight's fabulous piece of heart goes to... Link! For the price of 220 rupees. Dear me. Let me just say congratulations! Noit! My thumb hurts. As it should. I've never seen such a fat wallet. That kid was a bidding machine right up till the end. But now then, on to business. Okay. Now, he sells other stuff. More specifically, he sells treasure charts. And while I'm not going for 100%, I do want these. So I'm going to be cutting and getting all of the ones he has. Alright, I do believe that I have cleaned out the auction for everything. I got a treasure chart and the heart piece that I showed, uh, but I think that's it, that all that he has. But, I would like to come up here. Because there isn't really a side quest thing for, for me to do right now. Let me just check. Yeah, there isn't at the moment. But, in fact, we're going to be pretty much ignoring this for the time being. But if I get down there on the stage... Wait, talk to him first. See what he okay, has to say. Okay, fine. Hmm? I wonder if a boy like you will do. It's difficult to tell. Yes, difficult. You see, my one and only daughter, Myla... Mila? Myla? Myla. Myla was taken away from me to a frightening place no called the Forsaken Fortress. I've asked many to rescue her, but it seems to be a difficult voyage to that cursed place. We're going there later. 
Oh, to see my sweet Myla again, my precious little daughter. I worry over her welfare. I can't recall the last time I slept more than a wink. I sincerely wonder about the wisdom of asking a boy like you to do this. But would you lend a hand to help rescue my precious daughter? I assure you, if you do rescue her, I will pay you. As much money as it takes. I'd give my entire fortune for her safety. Okay, whatever, dude. I'm not here for him. I'm here to just walk off this ledge and drop down. Because now I'm on the stage. And today's auction will be advert or will be selling Link. Okay, whatever. <laughs> if we go down over here, there's a chest, and I believe it has a something in it. Red rupee? Yeah. It's it's neat, I guess. Okay. And if we break those pots, we'll be forced to pay money. A lot of money. So don't break the pots, ever. Isn't it like 200 rupees? I'm not sure, but it's pretty steep. Okay, Nova, where are we going next? Daytime? Yeah. Okay. Let's go play hide-and-seek. Okay, that's that's a good thing to do. Hide-and-seek's fun. Alright. Let's go here. And change. The day into night. Oh, wait. Oops. What is it? What is it? No, 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 it's this. Right, left, down. Okay. I remember. Not really. <laughs> you remembered for me. But League of Legends, though, we both want to play. Really badly. <laughs> because I got ranked in silver, and Nova, silver 2 to be exact, and Nova's jealous. You can jealous. be quiet now. Nova's just jealous of me. Quiet. Of course, Ryan is a little bit, too. It feels good. Feels good being up here in silver above Shh. bronze. Okay. This town. Oh, we haven't talked to them before. This town is our turf. The turf of the world. The famous killer bees. Don't mess with us. Yeah. Or oh, sorry. Yeah. Buzz, buzz. They're so intimidating. You stink, mister. We ain't seen your face around here before, bud. Okay. Hey! It's just because you're older. Don't think that makes you tough or anything. I'll decapitate all of you. Okay, now how do we do this? Do we talk to their teacher? Hey! Yeah, we talk to their teacher. Let's go do that. Teacher! I'm right, right? I think so. Okay. Hello, teacher! How are you? I've never gone to school before. <laughs> Welcome to Miss Marie's School of Joy. I don't think I've ever seen your face around here before, my young scholar. Are you a new pupil? Uh, no. Girl. What can I do for you this fine day? We need to talk about something. I know I may look a bit flashy for a teacher, but I assure, assure you that I am one. How long has it been since I opened my school here on Windfall Island? Twenty years. Ever since then, I've been teaching the children of this island about true joy. But I do have a rather joyless problem. There's this delinquent gang of four young boys who never listen to a word I say. Even though I wait patiently for those young boys to show up, they never come. It's as if they don't want joy in their hearts. Could you please catch their leader, that little boy named Ivan, and kill him for me? Or talk some sense into him? Please, young man, for me? Yes, ma'am. Oh, thank you so much. You're a dear. They're such troublesome little boys. I'm at my wit's end over how to deal with them. That's a good item. <laughs> but they can be so mean to a boy their own age. Or, wait. But they won't be so mean to a boy their own age, will they? I should think not. Good luck, m y Mr. Man. Goodbye, Mrs. Woman. <laughs> nice Julia Child impression. Julia Child- who is that? I don't- I don't know. Never mind. <laughs> okay, I have known the name, I don't know the face. Link's <laughs> face. Oh, uh, Link's Notice face. how Link looks mad at everyone but these guys. <laughs> yeah! Yo, bud! You got a problem with us killer bees, huh? Do ya? Don't tell me it's that annoying hag of a teacher again, is it? You came here to give us a talking to because Mrs. Marie asked you to, right? Tell us not to skip school, right, bud? Tell us not to be tardy, right, bud? <laughs> eat, eat your vegetables, they said. <laughs> Brush your teeth and go to bed, they said. Put down that gun, they said. Well, forget about all that. We're the mighty and invincible gang of four, the killer bees. Do you think we'd listen to a chump like you? 
But I'll tell you what, bud. If you want to challenge us to a competition, then maybe we'll think about listening a little bit. What do you say, bud? Do you want to challenge us? I'll take you on. I have a sword. I got the master sword. Yo. Okay, your funeral, bud. The rules are simple. We're going to hide somewhere, and if you find us, we're going to run. You got to try and catch us and shoot us with your bow. Easy as that, bud. We won't hide indoors or nothing. And we won't leave this island, because how on earth would we? So look for us around in the shadows and behind buildings and stuff. If you catch all four of us, we lose. You got it, bud? Ready? Go! <laughs> okay, I know where all of them hide, but I'm not going to say anything. I'm going to let you fail the first time. Hey, hey. Uh, I'll do a good job. I won't let you down. Okay. Um, I believe... <laughs> Nah. 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 Just give me. You missed the rupee. I don't care. There's no time limit, you know. Nah! Found him. Can you find out their names? Nah. I'm evil. Look their little legs go. <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, oh, oh. You can't stop my dunks. You can't match my hustle. Okay, it's time to take him from the ground. Ground assault! Nah! You're awesome! <laughs> They're possessed, by the way. Not sure if you knew. Okay, I know where one of them is, but I want to find out. Is it over here? No. Okay, one of them's behind that grave over there. They made a grave mistake. <laughs> okay, come over here. Ta I know you're hiding something. You're hiding people in your basement. No, I run like a little girl because all little girls run like that. I just <laughs> I just broke my all the bones in my body. <laughs> nope, tot, go away. Uh, can I fly over there? Wind. No. no Aerial wind. assault. Na da 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 ba ba da ba ba da 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 why you got me? Okay, next one. Yes, I see the guy on the tree. I'm saving him for last. Okay, where's the last guy? Is he around here? Yeah, 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 he's over here. Uh, the wind's going... The wrong way. Really? Okay, um, you know what? No, I'm too good for this. Ah! That was close. Oh, hi. Are you ready to meet your maker? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got him right down his head. He has no skull. Yakwa. Ooh. <laughs> Apparently, by hitting his, him in the face, he drops some arrows. Okay. Um. You know what? Yeah. Okay. Come here, Mr. Man. I'll mess you up with this pot. Don't think I won't. Do not think I won't. I'll mess you up with this pot. How can you run so fast? Wait, are you just really just running in circles? Oh, no, okay, you're better than that. It's enough to get away from you. Hey, I, I have a pot. Throw it. No, I'm not going to throw it. Where are you going? Oh, snap. Okay, I'm going to head him off the pass. It's going to go the other way. Yep, 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 that's good. I'll head him off, head him off, head him off. Hello! No. Wait, are you... He's juking me. Come on. I want to catch him with the pot. I am the pot master. You Don't might want to rethink that title. I want to catch you with a pot. Yes. Oh, I sit down the pot too. <laughs> oh, lame. Yeah. You never stop my dunks. Never match my hustle. I'm just going to leave this pot right next to you. Okay, last person is Ivan the Terrible. Or as I like to call him, <laughs> Ivan, Ivan the, the awesome. awesome. Okay. Ivan, meet your maker. No, no, no. No, I don't want the creepy man. I want the tree. <sighs> tree! There we go. Now, one of the end slates, I think it was last... No, it wasn't last episodes. But we, we did an end slate once. It never made it into the final episode. Where we got on top of that tree... And we looked at stuff. And if you get on top of that tree, because you can, uh, 
and with Ivan there, he actually won't do anything. You actually, you have to run into the tree to get him. You got me. <laughs> you like the voice I'm giving these people? No, I don't think they're very fitting. Marg! I can't believe it. You found all four of us, and you caught us too. Talk about utter defeat. Looks like we lost our touch, killer bees. I guess maybe it's time we chilled out. From now on, we won't cause any more trouble for anyone. And reward your hide-and-seek seeking skills. Here, take this, bud. Piece of art! Now, where that would they have found one of those? I don't know. Oh, they stole it. Ah, this is our favorite possession. But you've proven me that you're worthy. To our bud, the hide-and-seek master. Oh, and one more thing. We need you to apologize to Miss Marie for us. All right? We're counting on you, bud. See ya, Pokey. Where are we going? We can apologize later. Uh, we're going up here, right? Up there? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Not sure exactly how much time we have left, but I'll assume that with all the cuts, we have just enough time to do this. Actually, never mind. This is the curse of us playing this game before, is that we're not sure of the order that things would go, and so stuff like this happens. So let's just go in here and talk to Mr. Man. Why, young sir, Ooh. I must say, you seem to be in possession of a very fine picto box there. Are you a lover of fi pictographs as well? There can be no villains among the ranks of picto box lovers. Take your time. Look around. I implore you. Okay. Uh, let's go. Nice man, I guess, maybe. He's gotten some pictures in his time. Sorry, pictographs in his time. Oh, 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 you've stepped into my lair. No. Aren't these are these some finely snapped pictographs? You must admit it. But, oh, come now. You needn't be so surprised, young sir. It is a hobby of mine to sneak up behind people when uh -huh. they least expect it. <laughs> it's quite an amusing diversion. Think nothing of it. <laughs> Unless I have a knife. By the way, the pictographs you see decorating these fine walls have all been taken by none other than myself. These are my pride and joy. You see, in my younger days, I was a tire well, I was tireless, sailing far and wide across the great sea, snapping t pictographs wherever I went. Have a look at them, y young sir. Uh, choo-choos. They're choo-choos, yeah, yeah, medicinal properties, blah, blah, blah. That, this is a mighty f nice pictograph. Uh, this is one of a tiny rock islet. Yeah, we've seen it before. There's a butler. Interesting, okay. Once again, if you guys are interested, just pause Pause the what video. What does he say about part. Tingle? A strange platform rising up out of the sea is seeming to cloud the sky. It makes for an even stranger silhouette. I wonder if such things still remain out there in the high seas, lonely on the waves. Uh, if only I had a chance, I'd do the stuff. Uh, that's outset. Don't really care. This is interesting. Ooh. What kind of pictograph is this, you ask? One ill-fated day, misfortune befell me, and my boat was destroyed. Clinging to the wreckage, I drifted at the whims of the waves. When I, that's when I saw this monstrosity. This foul ship, veiled in mist and failing in and out of sight like something in another world. Yeah, or of another world. Yes, my young sir. Tis none other than the ghost ship. The rumors I've heard tell of a man who researched the, sea, the reaches of the sea where the ghost ship faded in and out of sight. That he drew a map of its movements. But it is said that as soon as that man had finished drawing the lines of that cursed map, he died a most unexpected death. Ch chilling. Truly chilling. Now, if one were able to find that map, then it might be possible to sneak onto the ghost ship and get the treasure that is said to lurk within its hole. That sounds like a massive hint right do, there. Do, 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 do. This is from Skyward Sword. This is really from Skyward Sword. Oh my goodness, this is from Skyward Sword. Okay. You mean Skyward Sword is from this? Yeah. Seriously, though. Seriously. Okay, this may not be intentional, but it's intentional. Ghost ship, right next to it, is the main secret from the sand ship of Skyward... Ugh. Sorry. I have no idea what you're talking about. Fangirling. How do you get in there? Through the door that we tried to enter and okay. failed. Okay. Uh, what do we do again with him? 
I honestly don't remember. <laughs> okay, we're gonna cut to when we do some. Oh, come here, come on, come here, come here, bud, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Throw it at him. Let me throw this stool at your face. <laughs> you see, young sir, I've been studying picto boxes since I was but a lad. My lifelong dreams of creating a box with incredible pictography capabilities is at long last nearing fru fruition. Young sir, I hesitate to ask, but could you perchance be my research assistant? G goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh, really, really and truly, I'm just going to sneak up behind you one of these days and... Knife you! <laughs> assist you. My heart leaps at your enthusiasm, but I feel I must tell you, the path of an assistant must follow, uh, must follow is not a simple one. I demand that whosoever takes on the role of my assistant be an individual who can take whatever command I may issue and promptly complete it without hesitation. His sentences are tongue twisters. Yeah, they kind that of That was are. one sentence. It will be quite a challenge, I assure you. Are you still sure you want to do this? Sure. Ha! You must share my love for the pictograph. What is your name, young sir? Link, is it? Very well, then. I shall issue three commands to you. On the dawn of the day, you complete all three tasks. You shall be my number one assistant, Link. I'm your only one. Now then, for my first command. A love letter. Do you know what that is, young sir? It is a collection of words of love, long unspoken and put into written form. Somewhere in this town, there is one who, despite constant rejection, never learns the cold lesson of unrequited passion and continues to write letters of doomed love. This... what are these tongue twisters? I am certain the object of this sadly one-sided affection is in quite a quandary of the matter. I am of the mind that I must have a word with the unwanted suitor. However, I must have physical evidence. And thus, your first task is to snap a pictograph of this individual in the act of sending the unwanted letters. That sounds easy, does it not? Rightly so. If you hope to be my assistant, you must perform this ta with task with ease. Wow. That was text. And I'm, my face is tingling from all that text. My goodness. Okay, let's go. Now... What we're supposed to do is, this is the love to which he is referring to, right there. And there's this dude- I don't believe so. Pretty sure I'm right. He mentioned letters, and there's one guy that frequents the mailbox, isn't there? Yes, and we will be dealing with that next episode. Sadly, we've run over on time, and I don't want this to be a, a two-hour episode. So, I'm going to be cutting it here, and in Nova's episode, we will be finishing out the heart pieces of Windfall Island and hopefully grabbing some more along the way. I want to knock out a lot of side quests here, um, because once we do, then we can do a lot more story stuff. So we're going to be getting a, ton a lot of more heart pieces next time. Thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please, please click, like, click. Why do I always stutter during this? Let's do that again. <laughs> if you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, if you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please click like, and if you haven't done so already, then... What is your issue? If you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please click like, and if you didn't, then drop a comment telling me how I can- st Don't- Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> if you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please- If you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please click like, and if- if you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please click like, and if you didn't, then drop a comment telling me how I could make the next episode so that you would like it. I release new episodes of Wind Waker Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays, and join us next time in Nova's episode where we are going to get a lot more done. Now that I've done the groundwork, she's going to finish things out and get a lot of heart pieces. My face is tingling from all this talking. Your face is tingling from failure. I am silver too. Be quiet. I am silver stinking too. You cannot stop my dunks. You can't match my hustle. Go away. <laughs> Next episode, I'll go away. See you guys then.